I'm your superhero critic and welcome to day 10 of my 12 days of Christmas. We're down to the last three good people. So, without further ado, let's get back to the original order I was doing everything in. And once again, can't open the gifts properly. But, today we're going to look at... Bushroot is at the mall talking about how dangerous we become as he's trampled by mall patrons and beaten the crap out of. Bushroot then vows to get revenge while DW is seen decorating his tree as we see Goslin being impatient and wanting to open her gifts. Bushroot then resurrects his fellow trees. To victory! Hup, two, three, four, hup, two, three, four, hup! Bushroot has his trees begin to frame others for things they haven't done. At the mall, DW sees everyone being robbed and jumps into action. Lunch pad, this is a job for... Santa Claus? Um, DW, I do believe that's the wrong suit, sir. Our nemesis is... Nemesi? Is that a word? Run into each other before Bushroot sends the trees to get our hero who responds with Tinsel. But if I can help it, Launchpad. Now suck Tinsel, Pinecone Breath! Bushroot commands all of his trees to steal people's gifts and as Bushroot continues to run amok and put DW on wraps. Somebody unwrap me. Shouldn't we wait until Christmas morning? Look here, you little shit. Fucking listen to your father. With Goslin's help, DW and Launchpad are shot into the air and they knock into Bushroot. But afterwards, he disappears, but reappears with his army of ornament throwing trees. DW's quick thinking quickly freezes his opponent. No! <laughs> no! All of the gifts have been returned except Goslin's friends, so she decides to donate all of hers as the episode ends with DW and LP questioning who bought her a sled. And that has been It's a Wonderful Leaf. Join me tomorrow when we look at a little tiny worm dude. <laughs>